Hi, I'm Eric Singer with Switchbacks FC, your home for everything that is the Colorado Springs Switchbacks. My city, my team. Head coach Steve Tritcher was here and Steve, big home season opener against Arizona United. So coach Caleb Ryman asks, what do you expect from Arizona in terms of quality of players and type of play they will bring? Caleb, good question. Uh, Arizona's coming in here uh, this year with a new co head coach and with a lot of new players. Uh, we've seen them play their last three games. You know, the first game they weren't very organized defensively and they, and they got taken apart by LA. But the last two games they, they've got together, they're organized, and they're actually a good team. They beat Seattle uh, last weekend and then they lost to Sacramento in the last 10 minutes this last weekend. So, you know, we expect a good game. Uh, I know they're going to come in here. The, 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 their coach is very uh, experienced. I mean, he's had some good experience in the MLS. So, you know, it's going to be a hard-fought game, but I have confidence in the guys that we're going to bring the energy and, and take it to them Saturday. Coach, does a bye week in between Oklahoma City and Arizona this early in the season help or hurt your team? Good question. Well, I guess we'll find out Saturday. Uh, you know, we tried to simulate uh, playing a game this last weekend, um, and we also are playing a college game during the week just, just to be sharp and, and stay game fit. But we, get, we were able to work on some things that we thought we can improve on from Oklahoma City. And, you know, I, like I said before, I think, I think the guys are going to play with confidence and we're going to take the Arizona this Saturday. Thanks, Coach. Now, let's talk to Switchbacks player Ronnie Argetta. Ronnie, you and other Switchbacks players have been active in the community this season. So, tell us about your recent experiences. Yes, we've been uh, currently active in the community uh, more so than last season. Uh, the one I, you know, I truly enjoyed the most was working with uh, students from Monroe Elementary down here at uh, Wagner Park. Um, that experience was uh, truly humbling because it, you know, it brought me back to my childhood and just seeing these kids, you know, underrepresented, uh, coming from low-income families, um, kids that really need, you know, the support and the time more than anything um, was truly touching. We pretty much did some ref refereeing, um, you know, we were there, they were, you know, just playing little side scrimmages and, um, you know, after that, you know, we took photos with them, we had, we signed some balls and um, it was a truly, it was a truly humbling experience. Ronnie, what do you enjoy most about being involved in our community? The one thing I enjoy most about being involved in the community is, um, you know, having the, having the people know that, that we truly care about them and that we, uh, you know, really appreciate their support. Ronnie, Chris Mott from Facebook asks, who is a character from a TV show or a book that you've always resonated with? In general, I think I could, uh, you know, resonate with characters from the movie 300, for example. Uh, you know, a very fierce, uh, battling type characters, and that's just the way I am, especially out on the field. Um, that's, you know, that's the way I see myself, just hungry for that ball and battling, you know, throwing guys off the ball and stuff like that, so I really enjoy that. Thanks, Ronnie. Got Switchbacks comments or questions for the next show? Go to the team's Twitter page at Switchbacks FC. Coaches and players could answer you on the next show. I'm Eric Singer with the Gazette. Thanks for watching Switchbacks FC. Remember, the home season opener is Saturday, April 9th at Switchback Stadium at 1.30 p.m. My city, my team. Go Switchbacks!